Welcome to the girlies in their awkward 20s. This one's for you. In the past four years, I've been pursuing this dream and vision of mine from God to be an entrepreneur, business owner, and to just simply create. Yo. That's kind of fun. I am 23 years old with an associate's double major in marketing and visual communication, but in the eyes of the corporate world, I am unemployed. Yes, I have no J-O-B, but I am fulfilling this vision of mine from God. You see, being in your early 20s is such an awkward phase in your life. You start to realize that everyone is on their own unique journey. And people that you knew since school are now getting married, having kids, and whatnot. Some people are still living with their parents, and some moved out. Some are financially stable, and some are struggling to make ends meet. But here's the thing. No matter where you are in life, I hope you know that you are never behind. What's meant for you won't pass you, and what's destined to be yours will find you. Nobody can take away what's meant to be yours. But at the end of the day, we're all human, and Sometimes we feel behind because we compare ourselves to others or the world sells us this idea that we need to be successful at a certain place in our life by now. And we might even feel the need to have the latest and the greatest or keeping up with all the trends and keeping up with the Joneses. And to be honest with you, I fell for it. I used to rush the process and try to get where I thought I wanted to be. And I thought that only once I get there, only then will I be happy. I had to unclench the idea of what I thought my future should look like. And I think the hardest thing you'll ever have to do is let yourself go. You can choose to be happy right now with what you have and where you are at in life. And if you feel like you're alone and stumbling through this maze, guess what? It's all a part of the journey to finding yourselves. So, grab a cup of tea, get cozy. I'm going to be sharing with you guys five lessons that I've learned so far from being in my awkward 20s. Lesson one, embracing the uncertainty. You know that feeling when someone asks you what you want to do in life and you're just like, mm, I have no idea. Yeah, welcome to your 20s. This is a time when uncertainty is your new best friend. But you know what? It's okay not to have it all figured out. And this phase is all about exploring, trying new things, and learning from each experience. For me, I believe your 20s is the perfect time to take risks. This is a time for trial and error. If you want to change your degree despite pursuing it for the past three years, do it. You want to change your job because you feel like it isn't sustainable for you in the long run, do it. This is a time to start that business run a marathon or whatever your heart desires. In your 20s, you have to be able to learn to pivot and embrace the uncertainty. Lesson two, comparison game. Social media might be a highlight reel, but trust me, everyone's dealing with their own struggles and demons behind closed doors. In your 20s, it's easy to fall into the trap of comparing yourself to others. But here's a secret. Everyone's journey is completely unique to their own. Your path might not look like your friends or your neighbors or that influencer you follow. And that's perfectly fine. Focus on your own growth and progress and run at the pace of grace. Lesson three, outgrowing toxic relationships. One of the most liberating things about your 20s is learning to outgrow people who don't align with your journey. It's tough, but surrounding yourself with positive, supportive individuals is crucial. Don't be afraid to let go of relationships that no longer serve your well-being or personal growth. You deserve a circle that uplifts you. You deserve friends that aren't envious of you. You deserve to be surrounded by people who you don't have to shrink yourself to be around. You'll know you have a good friend when you are allowed to be completely who you are around them and not have to change yourself just to fit in. Get married already! Lesson 4. Embracing self-discovery. Your 20s are a time
time of self-discovery. It's a chance to figure out what truly lights your soul on fire. Pursue your passions, explore new hobbies, and take risks. This is a time to make mistakes and fail and learn from them. There's nothing wrong with failure. Failure is a part of success. So embrace the journey of becoming the best version of yourself. And if you fell, at least you know that you tried, rather than wondering if you never did at all. Lesson 5. Embracing change. Change is the only constant, especially in your 20s. From career shifts to personal growth, be open to change. It might be scary, but it's also the gateway to amazing opportunities. Remember, your comfort zone is a beautiful place, but nothing ever grows there. Don't hide your godly given talents from the world because those talents that you have could change the world. Whether it being small or big, it is still valuable. You are valuable. So, to all my fellow 20 somethings out there, embrace the awkwardness, the uncertainty, and the ups and downs. This phase is a chapter of growth, exploration, and self discovery. Until next time, keep navigating those 20 like the rock star you are. Take care and stay fabulous!